everybody. Hello. How are you doing? How is your day, morning, evening going? I am recording this on Saturday night, but I probably will not upload it until tomorrow. So, because I want to give my Wix Wax Candle Company video some love, give it some space so people can watch it before I upload a Timu haul. But then again, I might upload this tonight. I don't know. But I do encourage you to watch that Wix Wax Candle Company video that is right, the video right before this one. There is a giveaway in it. I didn't put it in the title because I didn't want the bots or just the giveaway hoppers to come running. There are people who just search giveaway on YouTube and just go to all of those channels because they know that we have no way of knowing that you're subscribed to us or if you like the video or whatever. So unless you're like publicly su su subscribed and who the heck is publicly subscribed anymore these days? I'm not. I've got 900 subscriptions that are people that I'm subscribed to. If I made that list public, it would take up the whole, it would take up screens and screens. Okay. So this is take two. Is my board right there? No. Speaking of Wix Wax Candle Company, I've got one of their candles burning right now and it smells so good. And I can smell it from all the way downstairs. So it's got throw. And it's really, it's a really great candle. And I've got the great outdoor, fresh outdoors is the scent that I've got burning right now. And this is the second time I'm trying to make this video. Fortunately, I didn't get very far because Loki came up here and knocked over everything. He knocked over the light. He climbed all over things. He knocked over everything I had hauled so far. He made a mess and it was not fun. And I got impatient with him and told him to get down and voices were raised, mainly mine. And so now we're trying this again. So what I said was I owe Timu an apology because I had made that video saying this could be my last Timu haul for a while because all of my orders appeared to be lost. But today uh, and yesterday, bags showed up. So a small bag showed up. And then this big bag showed up today. And I figured I would just haul these. And then I've got more downstairs. So what I hauled before I was so ca catastrophically interrupted was the first thing I pulled out was a dupe of, now if any of you guys have tried this real wow spray for your hair, it's on Amazon and it is awesome. This is the dupe for it. And I've got the real stuff. I was just curious to see what the dupe was going to do, like how the dupe compared to the real spray. You spray this on damp hair, and it makes your hair soft and shiny and it just gives it some like, not body really, but gives it some lovely. Now I didn't use it today and I just got out of the shower, which is why my hair is so flat and just blah. But it just gives your hair some kind of like a magical effect where your hair looks amazing. The real wow. Now the, um, I don't know about Timu, version of that wow so I got it and I don't know how much this costs I can't I couldn't find it it's somewhere I don't know I I'm sure it'll turn up and then I'll tell you then the next thing I got were these are trying to be like perfumes I can't think of the kind of perfume that we have here in the states that kind of has this aesthetic to the box but this is she mong and perfume and I got two bottles of it I got Monet Garden and it, they're $5.48 a bottle Monet Garden has got top notes of honeysuckle and jasmine middle notes of tuberose and patchouli and a base note of honey so I want to I didn't get a chance to smell this before Loki went nuts so let me see Mm 
Mmm, it smells really good. I smell the honeysuckle and the honey. I love it. This is my favorite. I want to get clear. Add to cart. I want to get this again. Um, so this one is really good. And then I also got a, a one scent called Baby Bear. And so honeysuckle is one of my favorite smells out in nature. Let me quickly add this Monet garden to my cart before it's gone forever. Before it's gone forever. You never know. I'm sorry to shop while I'm doing a thing, but you just never know. Beans and turnips. Lily of the Valley. Okay, Baby Bear has top notes of orange and geranium. Middle notes of honeysuckle and jasmine and base notes of oak moss and lily of the valley. There's one called milk cookie, which is vanilla biscuits, coconut milk, and caramel. That's a top seller. There's one called toffee girl. There's one called summer neroli, which is probably really good. There is Monet Garden. Throw that in my cart, please. And then there is, which I really love, and peach and mandarin, which I just don't, I don't like perfumes that have vanilla in them, but who knows, as long as it's not like crazy vanilla, like maybe, I don't know, but for $5.48, you can play around with a bunch of these. Who's using my debit card? Someone just rented a movie? Someone rents a movie every Saturday night with my debit card on Amazon Prime. And my brother swears it's not him. And I keep an eye on my debit card, of course. And I don't have the energy to switch everything from my debit card off. So if somebody out there is somehow using my Prime account to rent movies, whatever. Just have fun with that. I don't care. I don't care. Now, if I start seeing charges somewhere else, obviously I'm going to call and cancel it. But every Saturday night, somebody rents a movie on my Prime account. And this is a set of three lipsticks. And it's, it's mildly annoying. Oops. No, Bixby. Okay, this is long-lasting three-color lipstick and lip gloss set. And it is $4.94. And you get three colors in here. You get... Get them all out. I'm always trying to find just that one lipstick, you guys. Looks like I got two of the same color, though. Now, listen. These two look exactly the same, don't they? They screwed up, I think, and put the same. Well, maybe I'll really like it. And then there's this, but it's supposed to be, now that doesn't look like, let me show you the picture and then you'll understand why I'm like, what in the world? When maybe, oh wait, there are different trios you can get. Oh, maybe I got the, I'm kind of boring trio. Oops. Okay, well, all right, yeah, never mind. Take that rant back. I take that rant back. Okay, so just pick. So it looks like they have lip gloss down here, maybe. Oh, they do. They have lip gloss down here, which there's no way I'm putting that on. It's going to make a mess. And then they have the lipstick up here. I could use some lipstick right now. I could use a lot right now. Okay. Sure, I like it. It's like the color of my natural lips, but a little bit darker. All right, and I'll try these two some other time. So lipstick junkie, that's me. Okay, so there's that. 
there's that. Next in here is Vanity, no, Candy Floss Famati. I have no idea what this is. I didn't know this was in here. I thought the only thing in here was perfume and lipstick. I bet this is more blush because I need new blush when I need blush. Okay, it's got four really cute, um, this is what I like, pale pink. That's what I want with a little bit darker if you wanna go darker. Perfect. Okay, now those were, I do remember seeing those like a few minutes ago in an order, but I don't know if it's in, I don't know where it is. Not that. Aha. Okay, $3.19 is how much that costs. And then the wow hair stuff is and I don't know if it works or not, $6.48. I hope I got a price adjustment on that. And then there should be one more thing in here that will be $2.97. And that is some more blush. Beauty. I must have all these stickers all over it. What in the world is that even supposed to say? I can't read it. It's in French. No, I don't know. Is that French? You can recycle it. Is that what it's trying to tell me? With the little cartoon? I think so. I think you can recycle this. Okay. Beauty. By, <laughs> by anchovy. I'm not a fan of anchovies. Especially in my blush. Okay, what? Get it out. Where are my scissors? Here they are. Here they are. I'm just going to cut the box open like this. Somebody said, you cut things open in the weirdest way. Yeah, I do get things open in the weirdest way. It's because I got these fingernails and it's hard to get them in boxes and get the blood. Okay. Please open. It's got all kinds of little different. You can blend it all up to make one beautiful color. So by Anchovy Beauty and it's Baked Blusher. Looking forward to trying that. Here, let me get my stuff bag and put this stuff in it right away so I'm not overwhelmed and sobbing at the end of the night with all this stuff. I'm gonna put the perfumes in here for now until I can put them on my perfume tray, which is overflowing now with cheap tea mooper. I have this perfume tray in my bathroom that used to just have my most prized perfumes, you know, like, beautiful ones that I had to save money for to buy and now it's just completely crowded with all this cheap Timu stuff and it's I don't know I need to really go through my perfumes and say do I really okay I can't fit wow and stuff I can't fit anything in stuff what is taking up all the room in here these I still haven't tried these yet. Okay, if I take these two out, then can I zip up my stuff bag? I feel like a grumpy old lady tonight. 
forgot one. I forgot a one blush palette. Okay, there. Put the stuff right here for right now. Then take these two things that I just had to take out. Just put them right there. Now let me consolidate my trash. And we are done with this bag. Okay, put the bag down here. And let's see what's in the next bag. Yay! Now, you're not going to believe it, but I bought this because I wanted to try it. It's one of those hair red light therapy head caps that helps you stimulate your hair follicles and which can meet the needs of different body parts. Okay, whatever. They're not allowed to just outright say it, but it's supposed to help your hair grow. And I read the, I've got the really expensive one by iRestore, except iRestore just upgraded theirs to like another really expensive one that works even better. Now, I the company is called iRestore and they make a, an intense, somewhere in this list of videos, there's a video of me wearing it. They make an intense um, helmet that I did wear every day for a year and it did grow back. Like it filled in a lot of this. Like this was all not there before I started using iRestore. And so why, if I have our iRestore, would I spend 32 bucks or whatever this costs on the Timu infrared cap. I don't know because this looked more comfortable and I wanted to know, I just wanted to check this one out. So you guys know me and my fascination with red light therapy. I love it so much. I love the whole concept of it. Now, can I get it open? I don't know. Okay, maybe I can't get it open. I could take off all my fingernails and then get it open. I can't get my nails under here to get this box open. Come on. Pry it open with the scissors. Cut it open. I might. Okay, just get it get up in here with these scissors and Get this thing out. Ouch, I almost hurt myself. That would have, one of these days I really am gonna hurt myself and will I upload the video? I don't, oh, there goes a fingernail. Shh. What, I was trying not to lose any fingernails. Okay, I'm getting it just needed a little help. It's slippery, you guys. Oh, no! Okay, here we go. Now, you guys have seen the infomercials for this thing. I'm sure you've seen infomercials or QVC. It's on QVC for this kind of, I call it the lower end version of the Ira store helmet because it's this soft cap. Okay, I'm, look, I've almost got it. How frustrating. It's mildly annoying. Okay, I got it. I did it. All right, it looks like some kind of a... Ugh. I don't know why I smelled it. Okay, and so, of course, though, you have to plug it in. Do I have a socket? Oh, no, I don't have a socket. Well, I kind of have a socket. I don't know if this is going to work or not. Let me see. I have a socket. 
I just don't know if I should have this many things plugged into it. It is an extension cord. Now, I know how y'all feel about extension cords. Okay, so it comes with this. Because, of course, it does... I was watching Haul in It with Mima, and she made me laugh talking about hoarding these bread tie things. I don't, I hate these bread, those bread tie things. I never put them back on the bread. I just twirl the bag around and flip it under or whatever. Okay, so let me figure out where I plug in this. Okay, I plug it in here. I'm stuck on Wrecking Ball now because Loki came in like a Wrecking Ball and really wrecked everything like a Wrecking Ball. He came in like a Wrecking Ball. His theme song. Oops. Oh, whatever. Okay, put that here. Oh. See, it's getting really hot. I'm just going to plug it in for a minute. And then if... I don't even think that works. I don't know if that socket even works. I'm scared. Okay, so here's the little helmet and then... Whoa! Okay. Put it on my head. <laughs> oh, no. It's so loose, though. How do you... Can you tighten it or no? Did some of the lights just go out? No. Jeez. What about this? Wait, do I have it on backwards? Because that doesn't look very fashionable. I think it just went out. Something just went out. Jeez. Put my arms down a little bit. All right, I don't know. Is that my thumbnail? Should I just leave it on for the rest of this haul? I look like a Shriner. Okay, what nail do I need to fix? This middle one? Oh, just forget it. Just forget it. Okay, so I think this was about $32, if I remember correctly. And you're supposed to use it. The instruction manual's in here. How often am I supposed to use this thing? I like, this is much more comfortable than I restore. Put the hat on the head. <laughs> How long? Should, okay, helps induce brainwave entertainment. Helps restore the brainwaves to a natural order. Okay, three levels adjustable pulse mode. Oh, I can pulse it? Really? Oh, look at it go. Okay, there's that. Okay. Jeez. <laughs> I look like a crazy person. All right, it doesn't say how long you're supposed to use it, though. Like, how long do I leave it on? Once turned on, it will automatically turn off after 20 minutes. Okay, it's recommended to use three to four times a week. It can promote the proliferation of brain cells, speed up cell energy metabolism, and relax the brain. It can also reduce oil production, decrease sh shedding, promote hair growth, restore hair, help blah, restore hair growth, healthy cycle, and repair damaged hair. Okay. I'm excited. Oh, wait, I better turn this off in case one of you guys is sent. Don't look if you're sensitive to flashing lights. Here. Just put it on that. What is what does it do if it doesn't if it's not flashing? If it's just on mode number one. Short term continuous treatment. Okay. All right. Cool. Watch as everything in my bedroom just bursts into flames because of all this stuff that I have plugged in. Okay, what did I pay for that? I don't know. I'll find it, though. I'm going to see how much it costs now and what I paid for this thing. Good Lord. 
I need my glasses. Wait a minute. Oh, I took them off. I took them totally off for the hat. Okay. Let me find my helmet. Little helmet. There it is. Oh no, I bought two of that thing on accident. Not this thing, but I bought two of something else on accident. Oh, okay. $32.99 and I got a price, bleh, price adjustment. It's now $29.89. You can get it in black and the gray is sold out. That's fine. Black is cool. All right. Now, the next thing in here... I got this for my brother, and as you can see, it did not, oh, it did not travel well. He's a Led Zeppelin fanatic, and I'm not happy about it, but there, I kind of fixed it, right? Uh. Annoyed. The word of the day is annoying. As in, everything is annoying. No, stop that. Well, he won't care. Okay, Led Zeppelin. Cool. Okay, it's been a while since I bought a tin sign. It looks better than it did when I first took it out, though. Tin Led Zeppelin sign, I'm going to say three forty eight, dollars just off the top of my prices right head. It was five forty eight. Okay. All right, five forty eight. Put that there. The next thing in here is something in a little uh oh, I think it's a purse. How's the hair doing? Is it growing? It's in a little bag. It looks like a French fry. Now I want French fries. Okay, so this has got a Louis Vuitton vibe, except it's got a cat on it. <laughs> hey, look at my Louis Vuitton. And my funky little, and my other cat too. We love cats. All right, so it's got kind of the Louis Vuitton-ish looking things. And then it ruins it with this. And of course it ruins it with whatever the heck that says. Here's another cat's paw. Here's a cat's paw. I thought it was cute. It's cute. The dark one, which is the one I really kind of wanted, was sold out. All right, it's got a pocket here. Okay, does it have feet? No, it doesn't have a pocket in the back. No, but it does zip, which is kind of nice. And, I mean, it's a nice purse, actually. Let's open it up. Get inside of it. It's got a strap that says fashion and, and classic. I forgot the C. Fashion and classic. Fashion and classic. I don't know. Why? Why couldn't they have just given us a brown strap? Please? Would that have been so hard? Would it have been so hard? I'm putting it on. You know what? No, I'm not. Maybe I am. The simplest things, I swear. I can't. I can't imagine to those women with those really long nails how they get anything done. Like, how do they even type? You know, like, ouch. Okay, here's one. Does it, please tell me it swivels. Okay, good. All right. Um, okay. Oops, it's messing up my. What's happening? Is all this all right? Okay. Okay. 
There's a hole in the bucket, dear Liza, dear Liza. All right, maybe I won't get this side on. It's fine. We don't need that side on. Okay, what else is in here? Paper. Okay, and then inside there is a really small zipper pocket in there. And there is not a slip pocket, but there is a little, the finest quality. There's a little patch in here telling me that this is the finest quality. And it smells okay. I th and then here's the little cat close up, which is cute. And the other little paw, I think that's cute. I wish it didn't. I'm, yeah, I know I could try to take this off with nail polish remover, but, and then also why right here though? That is one reason why I didn't want to get the dark one because this stood out really, um, this stood out a lot on the dark one. And with this one, at least it kind of blends in a little bit with the trim or whatever you call it, but I don't know. I'll use it a couple of times and then I'll donate it. I'll use it a few times. Here's the back. The back is nice. I just always feel like this kind of purse. People are like, you can't afford a real one. I can't afford a real. I cannot afford a real one. Okay, so that was $20.98. It's now $15.99. And here's what I'm talking about. Here's the one I really wanted, but look at the name of the purse in big letters on the side. I mean, come on, really? Why? Why would they want to do that? Yeah, here's another one that's um, got like the symbols on it and stuff, but it has that Lou, Lou you dare or whatever in really big letters on it and then down below. So whatever with that. Okay. Well, that was exciting. And then the little, it's not really a dust bag. It's like a paper bag. My head feels all warm and stimulated. Okay. Next, um, put that there. We have a little box. It's supposed to start raining any minute. I always end up talking about the weather and it's supposed to rain all day tomorrow. I'm kind of looking forward to it. I might sleep again all day tomorrow. I'm tired. Tired in my bones. I got a couple of Toki Doki blind boxes, and I wonder if that's what this is in here. Yes, it is. I'm going to have to glue that down. It is bothering me. So these are the Toki Doki unicorn blind boxes. Now they were for Christmas, but you know, whatever. And you get a different unicorn. You don't know what. I really want the gingerbread one, but never hope for too much with these blind boxes because in my experience, and I hate to sound like a downer, what is this? I always get the one the one I want the least. So I try and there are some mystery ones. All right. All right, I got two of these. So let's open this one. I got two of these on purpose, not on accident. And the Toki Doki blind boxes are 12.48 as usual. Timu hot sales. All right, where do you open this thing? I'm just going to have to rip it open like this. Because I can't fit. Unicorno is its name. 
and it comes in a little foil bag and it's got a little pamphlet that's got all the different ones. I love Toki Doki. I can't believe they had this on there. I was like, Toki Doki? Really? On Timu? All right, let's see what it is. Dun, 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 dun. Oh, cool. All right, it's a Santa Claus one with a little gift wrap around it and a Santa hat. Okay. I mean, all right. I think that's an exciting one. Is that a rare one? I don't know. No, because it's right there. If you can see it, it's not rare, right? The rare ones are like the mystery ones. Where are my glasses? I really, the gingerbread one, though, maybe the next one will have the gingerbread one in it. Okay, ginger. Okay, um, Noel. Well, there's one with Santa Claus on it naughty or nice there's a snowflake one there's a peppermint stick here's here are all the different ones okay all right cool let me go let me open my other one that was exciting i should keep the box but nah I can't believe, never mind, I, I've already said that once, but I just I was shocked to find Toki Doki on Timu, and I meant to do another search to see what other Toki Doki things they had on Timu, and I forgot. I would do it right now, but that would be rude. I already went shopping for perfume once on this video. Okay. Oh, this is not the Christmas one. This is a blind, this is the unicorn blind box, but it is, is it Valentine's Day? Hold on a minute. What am I wearing? I'm wearing Nope Not Today sparkly t-shirt from Timu. But I can't remember when I got it and I'm wearing the hair growing hat and I'm still wearing these earrings again with the hearts on the hoops because I love them. And of course, you know, my fashionable glasses chain. And this is the Lunar New Year Toki Doki Unicorns. All right. Very cool. I'm excited. And I think they're different astrological signs or something. I don't know. We will find out. And once again, I am going to... Oh, I can open it down here. There's Marmalade, there's Chaser, there's Tranquilla, Sea Green, Festiva, and Firecracker. Please, I really don't want the Firecracker one. All right. It's the Marmalade one, which is... Another one that I didn't really want, but it's all right. So she got a little orange or whatever in her mane, and she's eating a little, I'm going to say good luck red envelope and a couple of these little things on her. And I should have got more because I really wanted that. There's one that I really, that's the problem with blind boxes is if there's one that you really want, then you want to keep buying the blind boxes in the hopes that you get it. 
Here, let me see if the Lunar New Year one is sold out. Okay, for Chinese New Year 948, it is sold out. Oh, to hell with you. Okay. <clears throat> Tokidoki Christmas Holiday Unicorns. I don't care that much about that one. Okay, so 948 was what I paid for the Lunar New Year. And then 1248 is how much the holiday unicorns are. Okay, that's enough toys for one day. And then I got, what else is in this bag? What are we doing on time? 40 minutes? It seems about right. Um, this is a box. But before we get to that, here's the thing I bought twice on accident. Oh my gosh. So I had these jewelry wipes in my cart, right? And then Timu's like, we took this item in your cart and we knocked it down to $8.39 or something. And I said, okay, cool. But they just added another one and kept the original one in my cart. So I spent $11.49 on one of these and $8.39 on the other one. And I got two of them. So what I'm probably going to do is put this one in a gift, in a giveaway box. They're little, um, you wipe your jewelry with it. I don't know. Precious metal rubbing paper portable. I have no idea. We, you clean your... um. You clean your jewelry with them. I didn't realize people were texting me. Okay, so those are these are really expensive. I mean, eight thirty nine and eleven forty nine. They are now ten thirty four. They better be good. Or they? I don't know what they're even supposed to do. Okay, finally the last, the freakiest thing of all. I think. Let me make sure. Okay, now I can use this for trash. Is this thing still on? No, it turned off. It turned off. I'm sitting here with this thing on my head. Hold on, let me get let me get organized here for a minute. Get the trash in here. This trash can go in here. This trash can go in here. This trash can go in here. And then... Last, but certainly not least, this hat can unplug. Ooh. Okay, put this thing somewhere. I'm scared of it. Candle is still doing good. Still smells good. That candle is awesome. Okay. Now, let's see. Scissors. This thing, I saw this and I was like, is this thing serious? Is this thing for real? And does this is this thing really as freaky as it looks in the picture? And what little children can I scare with it? Dun 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 dun. It's nice that they put it in a box. And it is most likely going in a creepy giveaway box. I don't really plan on, I don't know, I'll have to see it. Maybe I'll love it. Oh my God. <laughs> okay, the thing that I, when somebody intends for something to be cute, and it ends up being really, really creepy, at least in my humble opinion, 
first of all, what did I pay for this before I show it to you? $20.98. And it's still $20.98. Monkey plush doll. Soft, fluffy friend. Present for... Hold on. Present for what? Present for... I'll show it to you. I'll show it to you. Present for every age. It's a... It's a monkey. Look at how horrifying that look. He's holding out an orange. Look at his scary face. Cheese. Anyway, I think it's terrifying looking. I think it's terrifying looking. It looks scarier in the picture though, kind of. What do you think? Let me know. Is it terrifying? Terrifying. Well, it doesn't help that there's like a fluffy pink cat in the background. Turn this around. You're ruining my shot. Okay, it looks like it wants to bite you with those teeth. Ooh, the little orange is just kind of... Okay. I don't like it. It's very, very soft. And here's what the picture looks like. Picture looks like this. That looks really creepy to me. It looks like it, one of those clang, clang, clang monkeys that clang the symbols together. All right, that's my Timu haul, you guys. What did I like the most? Um, well, I like the perfume. I liked the perfume. I like the Tokidoki blind boxes. I like the hair helmet. My hair feels, my scalp feels good now. And yeah, I like this whole haul, actually. I like the makeup. I liked it. I liked it all. I liked it all. Really wasn't that big of a haul, but we made it for 47 minutes and 15 seconds. So now I have to decide whether I'm going to upload this tonight or tomorrow. But either way, I hope you're having a good one. And I love and appreciate you guys so much. And thank you for watching. And thank you for hitting the thumbs up button. And thank you for checking to see if you're still subscribed. And you didn't get unsubscribed by YouTube. And I will talk to you very, very soon. All right. How do I stop this thing?